Alright, I'm going to start off this video with my minor critiques for this game only because the rest of it is going to be filled with unabashed praise. Um, right now, I'm waiting to hear some voice acting. I do think it'll end up being in the final game, but it is a little weird that we haven't heard any voices for these characters yet. And my second critique is I agree with some of the feedback online that they did kind of play a little safe with the turtles designs, but I get it. You know, I've seen over the years how people tend to react when the Ninja Turtles don't look the way that person personally feels that they should look. So going with kind of like the classic 90s iconic design, I get it. It's safe, but it works. Um, that being said, I am super hyped for this game. You know, it's given me all of the vibes of the original arcade run mixed with probably my personal favorite Turtles game of all time, which is Turtles in Time. Um, so the fact that it seems to be kind of be combining the two for like a best of both worlds has me hype because I don't know about y'all, but I can't afford that mini arcade that came out a few years ago with uh, with both games, you know, in the little mini arcade cabinet. I don't got four hundred dollars like that. But having you know the nostalgic vibes with like an updated gameplay, uh, beat 'em up system is really really working right now, and I hope that this is a trend that leads to a bit of a resurgence to some of these um, kind of overlooked properties when it comes to side-scrolling beat-em-ups. They're simple, they're fun, they're great times. So, yeah.